When it comes to deworming your horse, we know you want to do everything you can to keep him healthy. We also know it can be a little overwhelming to look at all the different treatment choices on the product shelf. Today we're going to tell you what you need to know to deworm your adult horse correctly. Now for higher risk horses such as foals, young horses, and even geriatric animals, you need to talk to your veterinarian as their deworming needs will differ than the average adult horse. Horse owners have traditionally approached deworming seasonally with a year-round rotation approach alternating dewormers every month or so. We're going to talk about changing that strategy to control today's most threatening parasite with an approach recommended by today's leading equine parasite experts. Now the first step is to identify your horse's life stage and to understand the worms that are most important to target based on your horse's age. According to the most recent expert advice from the American Association of Equine Practitioners, the most important parasite that poses the greatest risk to the adult horse are small strongyles and tapeworms. Next, it's important to make sure you are picking an effective dewormer for your adult horse. Quest Gel and Quest Plus Gel are the only equine dewormers approved to control the adult and insisted larval stages of small strongyles, the adult and migrating larva of large strongyles, bots and other parasites in a single dose making them an effective broad spectrum option for deworming. Additionally, Quest Plus Gel helps control tapeworms. Now the second step is knowing the right time to deworm your horse. For most adult horses, the answer is twice per year, with Quest Gel at the beginning of the grazing season and Quest Plus Gel at the end of the grazing season. The ideal window will depend on what part of the country you live in. If you live in the northern half of the United States, your grazing season is likely shorter than six months. That means your first deworming should happen in April or May. And then aim to deworm your adult horse the second time in October or November. If you live in the southern half of the United States, your grazing season is likely longer than six months. That means your first deworming should happen in March or April and your second in November or December. Be sure to review your horse's individual deworming program with your veterinarian. When talking with your veterinarian, ask them to conduct a fecal egg count test on all of your horses at least once per year. Your horse's annual vaccination appointments are a great time for your veterinarian to conduct a fecal egg count test. While two deworming administrations at the start and the end of the grazing season are a baseline recommendation for every adult horse, the fecal egg count test results will help your veterinarian identify those horses who are high parasite egg shedders, and as such, they may need an additional one or two deworming treatments during the grazing season. Learn how you can give your horse the parasite control he deserves by visiting questhorse.com.